Greetings and welcome to this brand new video. In this video, I will show you how you can easily downgrade your A9 and A9X devices to any version they ever ran or they ever supported. We will be using Tardis Marula and the downgrade will work without blobs and without jailbreak. Tardis Marula is completely free and we are using Linux. You can use Ubuntu 22.04 or higher or x ubuntu 22.04 or higher for this video we will be downgrading this iphone se to ios 12.0 from ios 15 as you can see it right here so first of all you will have to get the terrors mula linux file it will be a tar file you can simply right click and then extract here and you will get this folder secondly you will need an IPSW for the version you want to downgrade to. You will get these files from the link in the description or in the pinned comment. It will also include a written guide and of course the Tardis Marula Linux version. Now after extracting, first of all, let's get the IPSW. You can simply head to the IPSW.me website. It is completely free and select your device. So I'm using an iPhone. Simply scroll down and select your device from here. So I'm using an iPhone SE. I will select it. Then from there, simply scroll down to the version you want to downgrade to. So for me, I will be downgrading to iOS 12.0. So I will simply select it from here and get the IPSW to my computer. If you are unable to correctly identify your device, you can simply hit identify my device and enter the model number here from the about section or from the back of your device and then hit identify my device. Simply open the folder you just extracted, then right click and open a new terminal. Type here sudo space chmod plus x, give it a space, drag the file in, press enter, type in your Linux password press enter then do the same for the second file sudo chmod plus x give it a space drag the other file in press enter now this process is complete now let's install some dependencies to make this work open a new terminal then simply type or paste these commands you will get these from the written guide from the pinned comment or the description paste and simply run these commands and this will prepare your Linux environment to run Tardis Marula without issues. Once complete you are good to go. Now at this point connect your device via USB and if it asks you trust please hit trust as you can see I have connected it now. Open a new terminal and simply run these commands sudo system ctl stop usb mux d and sudo usb mux d hyphen p hyphen f paste and run these commands type new linux password all right now you can simply minimize it do not close this terminal now where you have extracted the turdus marula file go to that folder and then open a new terminal type here sudo space dot slash rain underscore lib usb hyphen e d press enter type in your password for linux now from there get your device into dfu mode now my device is in the pawn dfu mode next is to run this command sudo dot slash i device restore space hyphen hyphen get hyphen shc block give it a space go back and drag and drop the IPSW for the version you want to downgrade. Press enter, enter 1. Once it is complete, you will see that the shc block.bin file is now saved at the block folder inside the extracted Turdus Merula folder. Once it is complete, your device will be in recovery mode get it into dfu mode again and then simply run the sudo dot slash rain underscore lib usb hyphen ed command again this will again get your device into pawn dfu mode then you will have to run this command sudo 
dot slash i device restore hyphen hyphen get hyphen pte block space hyphen hyphen load dot shc block give it a space and here simply drag the shc block dot bin file from the block folder inside the extracted terdas marula folder go back and then drag and drop the ipsw you just got press enter one and wait for the process to finish all right you will see the process will complete and now the pte block dot bin file will be saved to the same block folder as you can see it right here your phone will again get into recovery mode at this point again get it into dfu mode and again run the sudo dot slash rain underscore lib usb hyphen ed command press enter and it will again get your device into pawn dfu mode the next command is sudo dot slash i device restore hyphen o hyphen hyphen load hyphen pte block and give it a space now drag and drop the pte block dot bin file from the block folder where you have extracted the turdis marula then go back and drag and drop the ipsw you just got press enter one and now wait for the restore or the downgrade process to complete now type here yes but please note that this will erase all data on your device if you have data please back it up then pressing enter now here if your device gets stuck please repeat the process or you can use another version or you can simply try to restart usb mux d again and it will work for you all right guys after the restore process your device will again get into recovery mode at this point again get your device into dfu mode and then type this command sudo dot slash rain underscore lib usb hyphen tp give it a space on the terrace ruler folder block and drag and drop the pte block dot bin file into the terminal and then press enter and wait for the process to complete and this will boot your device to the ios version you have selected and then you will be able to set your device up as usual please note that this is a tether downgrade so each time you turn off your device or the battery runs out you will have to run the last command this one sudo dot slash rain underscore lib usb hyphen tp and then get it to the pte block dot bin file all right as you can see it right here my device booted up and now you can simply set it up as usual all right you can see it is now activating all right you can see it activated just fine yes you can use the touch id and passcode without issues passcode all right all right you can see a phone is on ios 12 i want to first of all show you the version general about you can see it is now on ios 12.0 of course everything works without issues all right yes you can set a passcode all right as you can see it works fine now just to make sure that you can install apps i have installed an ipa app right here before you can open it of course go to settings general scroll down to device management and trust the app from here make sure wi-fi is connected before you do so and you can open it without issues you can install your appropriate jailbreak app and then jailbreak your device without issues now before we end the video again if you turn your device off or the battery runs out this is a tethered downgrade you will have to run the very last command as you can see it right here along with the pta block dot bin file to boot your device each time 
that's all for this video guys if you still have questions please ask in the comment section and i will reply you as soon as possible i will see you in a new video goodbye and take care of yourself